going back uh, to the questions what I have here, the next one is a question by Nerai. And um, here the question is, when can we expect to see some exciting new launches from Mercedes-Benz India? Oh, uh, I think this is a question I already answered. <laughs> so let's go to the next one. Um, question by Sitard. Uh, he asks, mm, maintenance of Mercedes cars are much expensive than maintaining Audi or BMW. Is it a reality or a perception? So, uh, dear Sithard, here I can clearly say this is absolutely only a, a perception. The cost of ownership is one of our key focus areas and um, every Mercedes-Benz car, I can tell you, is very competitive if it comes to the total cost of ownership. And uh, we have a program in place what covers everything from financing, leasing, insuring. Uh, we have a service contract in place. We have roadside assistance. We have a three years warranty without mileage limitation. Uh, we have highest received values in the luxury segment. So, and if you put everything together, uh, it's completely peace of mind. Yeah? So you can be assured the total cost of ownership of Mercedes-Benz are at least one of the best what are available in the market. So uh, I'm happy if, if there's further questions on that to go more in detail. Uh, cost of ownership is a strength of Mercedes-Benz. So uh, moving on to the next question. It's a question by Yashita. And it is, will the increase in CBU duties further affect the prices of Mercedes-Benz cars? Yeah, here I have to say, um, Yashita, unfortunately, yes. We will have a price increase in, um, uh, from April 1st. And um, on the locally produced uh, products, there the price increase will be in a range from, from uh, 1 to 4 percent. And uh, looking at the CBUs, uh, there, due to the hike in taxes, the increase can be for some models even up to 20%. So this unfortunately is uh, no good news, uh, I know, but uh, actually we have to just um, uh, give these this higher costs coming out of taxes to our customers. Yeah? We cannot just bear it. Uh, generally, I have to say here, the taxes on automobiles in India are some of the highest in the world. And my personal wish is uh, that we find a way to discuss with the government and with all the responsible um, agencies uh, on, on that. Finally, high taxes lead just to higher prices. And uh, uh, here we have to come to compromises what uh, serve everybody involved into this business. But coming back to your question, yes, it has an impact on pricing. and. Uh, it will be valid from April 1st. Um, there is a next question by Sahil. And uh, it's about what is your strategy to regain the number one spot in Indian luxury car market? Mm, Sahil, this I would like to answer in a way uh, that this is not a task what we have and it's not a goal what we go for because finally we are in the luxury uh, uh, business and uh, our utmost priority is to enhance customer experience to provide our customers with a delightful experience in every single case um, uh, our customers are in contact with Mercedes-Benz we believe in giving value and uh, not in playing any number, gale, number games. Um, our job is, is to have a profitable and a sustainable business. And our job even more is, is it uh, to provide our customer with highest value for the price they pay for a uh, car of Mercedes-Benz. So no number games. Our position anyway is very strong in the 
classical sedan business. We are very strong in the luxury SUV business. There are competitors offering smaller cars uh, in, in, in other segments where we are not present right now. So compare apples with apples. Um, the number game is not what we are going for. Every single highly satisfied customer, this is the goal uh, we have here at Mercedes-Benz. So one more question, uh, would like to say thank you to Sanjay who asks, there are so many exciting financing opti options on other luxury cars. Why doesn't Mercedes offer tempting financing and other schemes? Um, oh, well, Sanjay, here I would like to answer you. Mercedes-Benz offers quite a range of competitive um, financing and, and leasing products. And uh, we are even in many aspects better than our competition. So uh, to give you an example, we launched newly Merconomics. This is a scheme what offers you financing in combination with insurance and a service contract. Um, the response is very good on that. And it's a, an innovative uh, product. <coughs> what is well received by the market. It's only one example. All the range of financing and leasing is available in Mercedes-Benz and we are even working on new schemes uh, to be introduced with quarter two in this year. I don't want to tell you too much right now on this, but from the beginning of April, we will have a new and very interesting financing product, especially for our new cars to come in the market. And with new cars, I'm talking, uh, for example, about the new A-Class or the new B-Class SA diesel. So the setup of our financial options is already quite good and um, will be increased and improved further. But Sanjay, thanks a lot for this question. So another question came in by Joseph Suresh. Hello, sir. In tier two cities, there is no showroom and service center for Mercedes-Benz. What is the reason? Um, OK, uh, maybe, uh, Joseph, you could give me a bit more uh, concrete input to this, because we are already in a number of tier two cities. Uh, maybe in, in, in yours, not yet. But if you tell me where you are, then I hopefully can tell you when we will be there in your city. The strategy, um, uh, Joseph, is uh, uh, quite clear. We are approaching more and more tier two and as well tier three cities and setting up showrooms and service facilities over there to be closer to our Mercedes-Benz customers all over India. This is in process. Today we have already 50 out, 58 outlets, and that's uh, the highest number of outlets uh, if you compare all the luxury brands. So the coverage is already quite good in 31 cities, but there is more to come. Uh, and in this year, we plan so far to add six more outlets to our net. But uh, Joseph, if you want, please uh, give me uh, uh, a few more information where you are, then I probably can answer a bit more. 